Welcome to Sandwiches of History. Today, from Woman's Favorite Cookbook of 1907, we're going to be making the egg sandwich number two. Woohoo! Now we have to boil an egg for 10 minutes. And yes, it did say to add the egg to boiling water, so don't at me about my technique, bro. Now we put that in the cold water. It doesn't say how long, but I'm going to give it about three minutes. Now we slice our hard boiled egg. Now we put that onto thin slices of buttered bread. Season with salt, pepper, and dry mustard. Okay, let's give this egg sandwich number two a go. This is tasty. The egg is perfectly cooked. The mustard powder is bringing a nice little tanginess to it. Salt and pepper is always welcome. I'll be honest, I have not boiled an egg that way, but I might just do that way from now on because it peeled really easily. None of the shells stuck and it's perfectly cooked. This is fantastic. I do want to plus it up a little bit though. I want a pickly pop so capers are entering the chat. Okay, let's give this egg sandwich number two, plussed up with capers. Go. Little pickly pops. Goes well with the mustard that's on here. Goes well with the eggs. Hmm. All right, so the original egg sandwich number two. Very pleasantly surprised. Uh, I, I like eggs, and I like uh, egg sandwiches. I wasn't sure about the cooking technique, but it turns out it's brilliant. It's better than how I normally do it. So I'm probably going to do that this way from now on. Nice use of uh, dry mustard in there to bring a little bit of a tang. I, I'm going to give the original a seven. Uh, plussed up with the capers, a little pickly pop, seven and a half. That is delicious. I'd say that I was going to finish it, but I already have. Um, would I make this again? Absolutely. Either one, plussed up or non-plussed up. They're both tasty. <laughs> Go figure. All right. See you tomorrow. Woohoo! Now I feel heavy metal. Woohoo! By the way, if you're wondering what a chafing dish is, there it is.